Today I want to show you some uh, Fatmax rotary lasers. Uh, this one is the L600 and this is not a lithium version. So this is the L600 that means that it works with the D-cell batteries. I'm going to show you later on. So first, what's the kit content? In this one you have really, really, really good detector. Uh, this detector has um, a window that uh, light up and it has a really big uh, detector window. This is important to catch up the lines so fast as you can. If you're standing 600 meters away, that this unit can do, you have this detector. This is really important. So the most market uh, lasers in the market has a small window. That means it's going to be difficult to catch up the line. Really uh, useful and uh, nice to have. Well, you see as well the, the variable bubbles here. So we have. Uh, we have the sound that you can set harder or lo louder or uh, lower. Um, it works on uh, two AA batteries and that's the detector. Also we have the bracket uh, holder for the detector of course. We have the tar ca uh, card and we have the glass. We're gonna go to the unit. First of all we have to put our batteries in. So I'm gonna slide the batteries in. Easy thing on this battery is, is you can buy them everywhere. I mean, if the battery unit was built in is broken after eight or nine years, well, this one you still can buy. Only don't forget, if you don't use this rotary for a long time, take the batteries out. One tip, if you uh, want to close it first here, pushing and then on the top. That's the way how you close it. In the, so you see here the... Um, the holder, the, the, the bracket, uh, of yeah, how you say it actually, I don't know, the tripod holder, sorry. 5.8 uh, connection is this, has no dot down. So we're going to switch it on. It's going to level himself. If it's leveled, uh, the LED is not blinking anymore and it will turn. Uh, just right away, I just put it in a uh, in, 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 uh, slope, so it takes a little bit longer. Right now it's leveled and uh, the tilt mode is on. As you see, tilt mode is on. What does it mean? If the rotary drops and someone uh, just put it back, it switches off or uh, the light will blink. If you don't do it, I'm gonna switch the unit off, the, the tilt mode off and just let them rotate. So the unit is rotating right now. And if someone just take it away or dropped it and put it back on place, it will level itself and go back uh, rotating again. Well, in this case, I will prefer to do the scan, uh, the tilt modes always on. If you forget it and someone drops it and he doesn't put it straight away on your level where he was working on, yeah, you are different on search and distance where he was working. So I always switch it on. That's my opinion. Then we have the slope function. This is the X function, the X uh, axis, and above we can see which axis it is going to be. So X plus, X2, X1, and this is I1 and I2. And uh, you can select this, or you can move it actually with this uh, arrows. And we're going to do it, and we're going to see it on the back how far or how fast this can move. And if you hear the sound, I don't know. It's a really, really good uh, servo engine that moves and quite fast. As you see on the background, it's not a straight line. Yeah, it's a straight line, but it's in slope. And this unit is a basic unit. Don't forget that. This is a basic unit. And for a basic unit, it has this unit also a double slope. And that's really interesting for this kind of price point unit. So right now I can push again and then I can use my I axis. And also I can move this. So that's really popular in the market people want double axis why because they have the water flowing away on, on one corner so for example i want to have the water on the street flowing away this this corner then i need a double axis rotary so this is a really useful unit for this kind of price points i mean this is a low budget um, uh, rotary laser and it works to 600 meters don't forget Every rotary laser and every line laser has some, uh, yeah, different, yeah, millimeters uh, specs on 10 meters. So this one has 2.2 um, .2 millimeters of 30 meters maximum. So this is a really good spec for a rotary in this kind of price point. Um, 
Also the detector, what I said, I love this de de detector for this unit. So it's a really, really good setup for a just easy rotary, uh, but can do everything. The only thing what you cannot do is has a remote function. You have no remote access. You cannot buy a remote for this unit. Yeah, you can buy it, but it doesn't work on this unit. And it has no scan mode. So there are two functions that you are missing. If you really want that, then you go to the 700 units. And the 700 units has this function always the, the detector and the remote and all that kind of stuff will deliver directly in the same package. But in this case, this is a basic unit and it still can do a lot. This is already more than enough for the most people that are doing some job side, job side jobs. So overall, a really good unit. One tip I want to give you. Uh, and you can work a little bit faster is buy a millimeter detector. Well, Fatmax has as well this detectors on the market and this has a millimeter detection. So as you see, it says up plus or minus in the millimeters. It's a really nice detector. I have another video from this unit, uh, but if you want to work a little bit faster than usual, take this one. Uh, why is this user so useful? As you see, it gives you, it shows you how many millimeters you're off your uh, line. And for example, you're gonna play some windows and you see with this detector that it is five millimeters off, you take some piece of wood from five millimeters and you put under the window and it's exactly on, on, on zero. So really useful uh, detector. Uh, I have another video as I said, but uh, yeah, it's a tip for me to, to, to let you know uh, which kind of r things you can expect from Fatmax, actually. It's a really good unit. Uh, right now you see as well one LED burning here of blinking, and that says it's off the level, of course, because my axes are working. So, small detail. But still, it's a really nice uh, unit. Think about it if you buy a rotary laser. Think about this rotary. I love this rotary because of the specs. As I said, it has 2.2 millimeters, maybe maximum off of 30 meters. And this rotary can work up to 600 meters. So it's a really, really good unit. Also, you can use it, of course, vertical mode. This is also possible and really nice. And then you have as well the dot up. So in this way, you can make one corner. Useful. Well, think about it and let me know if you have some questions.